Hello kids welcome to the maths class today's topic is angles the main objective of today's learning is to understand how to construct angles on left hand side first of all let us revise what is an angle when two rays meet at a common point an angle is formed Let's revise the parts of an angle. These two are the two arms of an angle and vertex is the point where the two arms meet. Today we are going to learn how to measure, calculate and draw angles. What do we use to draw angles? We use a protector. A protector looks like this let's see how to use a protector look for the upside down t in the middle of the straight line on your protector this needs to be exactly on the vertex of your angle remember it doesn't matter which way round the angle is you always need to line the upside down t to the vertex of the angle Today we are going to learn how to draw an angle on left hand side that is LHS. When we draw an angle on left side we see the lower part of the protector. So to draw an angle on left hand side read from the 0 degree and follow the lower part or inner set of numbers. Let's take one example. Draw an angle ABC is equal to 60 degree where BC is equal to 5 cm. So what is given to us? BC is equal to 5 cm and we have to draw an angle ABC equals to 60 degree. So, first of all, we will draw the line segment BC that is 5 cm measuring on a scale. Now, look at the upside down T on the protector and place it at point B. Now, start reading from the 0 degree and follow the lower set or the inner set of numbers on the protector. Now look for 60 degree on the protector in this way. Now join the line to form the angle. As you can see we have constructed angle ABC as 60 degree. Now kids let us do some construction and understand it more clearly. Now kids we will learn how to construct an angle on left hand side using a protector. Now let us see what is given to us. Draw line segment QR is equal to 6 cm and angle PQR is equal to 90 degree with steps. We have to draw an angle of 90 degree. First of all kids we have to write what is given to us and what we have to draw. So what is given to us? Line segment QR is equal to 6 cm. So let us write given line segment QR is equal to 6 cm. And what we have to draw? Angle PQR is equal to 90 degree. So let us write to draw Angle PQR is equal to 90 degree. First of all, we have to draw a line segment QR of 6 cm measurement. So, we will use a scale to measure the centimeter. So, first of all, we will start measuring from 0 till 6. So let us draw a straight line from 0 till 6 
using a scale. Now we have drawn QR 6 cm. Now we have to construct an angle of 90 degree. We have to construct an angle of 90 degree on left hand side. So we will use a protector to draw the angle. Now kids you must remember that we will see the middle line of the protector that is the upside down T. This middle line we have to put at the point Q to construct an angle. So we will put this line on point Q. Now we will look for 90 degree. 90 degree is over here. So we will mark over here and join this line using a scale or the other side of the protector. Now we have constructed an angle of 90 degree. And what is the name of the angle? Angle PQR. So we will write over here P. Now we have to write the steps that we have followed to construct the angle. So what is the first step that we have followed? First step is to draw QR 6 cm. So let us write over here draw line segment. QR is equal to 6 cm. Next step is to draw an angle of 90 degree at point Q. So we will write at point Q. Draw and Angle of 90 degree. And the last point is therefore angle PQR is equal to 90 degree. 90 degree angle is called right angle. So we will write over here. Right angle. Now let us draw one more angle on left hand side. Let us see what is given to us. Draw line segment YZ is equal to 7 cm and angle XYZ is equal to 120 degree without steps. Now let us first of all write what is given to us. And what we have to draw. So given line segment YZ is equal to 7 cm. And to draw angle XYZ is equal to 120 degrees. First of all, we will draw the line segment YZ 7 cm using a scale. So let us measure from 0 till 7 cm. Let us draw a straight line. Now we have drawn a line segment that is YZ 7 cm. Since we have to draw an angle at left hand side, we will place the protector at Y. We will place the upside down T that is the middle line at Y. Now kids, one thing you must remember that whenever we are constructing an angle at left hand side. We will look for the degrees at the lower line. There are two lines, upper line and lower line of the protector. 
we will look for the lower line for the degrees. So let us see where is 120 degree at the lower line of the protector. It is marked over here. So we will put a point over here and then join the line. What is the name of the angle? Angle XYZ. So we will write over here X. Angle XYZ is an angle of 120 degree. Since in the question it is written without steps, so we will not write the steps. Now kids, let us recall what we have learnt today. When we draw an angle on left side, we see the lower part or the inner set of the protector. Look for the upside down T in the middle of the straight line on your protector. This needs to be exactly on the vertex of your angle. To draw an angle on left hand side, read from the zero degree and follow the inner set or lower part of numbers on the protector. To construct an angle, first of all we must draw the line segment that is given to us. Then place the protector on the vertex. Then look for the degree of angle that is to be constructed. At last, join the line to form the angle. In this way, an angle on the left hand side is constructed. I hope kids, you have understood how to construct an angle on left hand side using a protector. Now, complete the homework that has been given to you in your snap homework. Thank you.